Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Anish and I'm back with another video. Finally, after almost two years out, I think it's about time that I get back to FIFA and I think this is the best time to get back into it. But before any of that, let's just get straight into the video. And for this video, we're going to look at this saucy little card. This beautiful, beautiful Leroy Sané card, which looks absolutely amazing. I mean, 99 pace. Like, really, this is an end game card with 99 sprint speed. So, you know, it's just going to be tearing through every single one. 94 shooting, 91 passing, dribbling is again amazing. 96, and everything else is just proper, proper, proper for an end game card. It's got power, free kick, flare, and, and you know, this is going to be an amazing card because it's also got five star skill boost. Weak foot again, four star, it doesn't really make a huge difference if they're good at shooting. And that's just about it for the card. Now let's get back into the important part of this video, which is the two SPCs. One is the Bayern Munich one, which gives you a prime mixed place pack. And the other one is the Bundesliga one, which gives you a small rare gold place pick. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and show you what this is and how we can get ahead with the SPC solution. Now this first one is going to cost you about 60k. Um, around 60 to 65,000 coins is what I'm expecting this to be at. Like I've looked at a few solutions, but this one is supposed to be the easiest one. So first of all, we got Handanovic, which is a pretty simple card. It goes for 14,000 coins. And let's build a small link here with the Inter Milan player. So that's going to be Skriniar, who goes for 8,400 coins right now, which is a little expensive. And then we got Kolarov, which goes for around 4,000 coins. So we got three of these green links done that creates a huge increase in the overall chemistry that we need. Up next, we have a pretty simple card, which should be easy to find, which is Dunk. And the CDM is going to be Rice. So that's again, two green links that should be like six and six. And uh, these two cards are pretty simple. They go for 100,000 each. And the right back, I'm going to go for Tavernier because we need a team of the season player and uh, this is the cheapest one that I could find so it's 17,000 coins and that is about it for the defense and I'm going to add this player right here Gagliardini as the center defensive midfielder again from Inter Milan that gives a green link again and that just completes the entire defense now we got four slots left and so we're going to be the part where it gets a little bit expensive because these cards seem to be going for a little too much right now we got Arthur and we got Aaron Ramsey. These two cards should in total cost you about 10,000 coins in my opinion. And the striker is Eden Dzeko. And Dzeko is supposed to be like a little cheaper compared to the rest of the strikers. Plus his uh, rating is going to help you a lot. And uh, then we got, we need one Bayern Munich player. And I figured I'd just go for Mark Roja. Mark Roja is going to cost you around 1,800 coins. And that completes the first set. And uh, you just need to buy this one. And the others are pretty cheap. Total should be around 60 to 65,000 coins. So that is the first one done. I'm not going to complete it obviously because I don't need this card. And the second one is the Bundesliga one where you need one Bundesliga player, one team of the season player, team of the season player minimum. 86 rating, which is going to be a little difficult to work with, but it's really not that expensive when you think about it for that card that you're getting. And then we need the chemistry of 60. So this is going to be the solution again this is again going to be the cheapest one that i could find and uh, i've looked around i've checked a few i've tried a few on my own and this one is the cheapest so first of all we're going to start with the goalkeeper consigli who is again going to be about a thousand thousand two hundred coins center back we're going to go for bastoni who is um pretty cheap i mean trust me he is going to be the easiest one to find because it's just twelve thousand coins for him and left back, we're going to use um, a random Bundesliga player because we need a, a good Bundesliga league. Like we need a few of these Bundesliga players because they're pretty high in ratings and they're pretty cheap as well. Also Nehaus, who is linked to Liverpool, hopefully we sign him and he is going to be around 12 to 30,000 coins. And we got Guerrero for the left wing, so that is the Bundesliga set done. Now let's move on to the one cards, like the cards that are pretty bit expensive compared to the rest. Also not to forget a Sherby and Quadrado that creates the defensive links that we need and that is it for the defense. And now we have the four spots for the most expensive ones, or should I say the ones that are pretty rare to find, like we 
have the center that can be field the Pozuelo because the striker that we're using is from the MLS, that's uh, Rossi, who is a magnitude rated team of the season card, which will go for around 24 to 25,000 points. Right wing, we got Burhaus. I mean, Burhaus is pretty cheap again, it's going to be like 12 to 17,000 coins. And we got Dusan Tadic. That completes the set for the second, uh, for the second set of the SPCs, which is the Bundesliga one. And that is it, like these two SPCs should cost you around, in my opinion, see the first one goes for around 62 to 65,000 coins, the second one is around 90,000 coins. I would say uh, around 150 to 160,000 coins for a card like this is pretty amazing, and if you're running a Bundesliga team, this card is going to be the end game card that you need, like that is it. And it is probably one of the best cards in there, I haven't used it, but I've used a few versions of uh, Leroy Sané and they have been amazing. So before I end this video, I'm just going to show you guys my team because this is my team right now and this is where I'm going to end it. I just need to make two more upgrades. That's going to be the White Naldum card and the Van Dyke team of the year. Also, I'm going to think about the Alexander Arnold team of the year and I will be done with FIFA 21. Again, I'm going to be uploading every single day. I do live stream every single day. So make sure you guys check that out and I'll catch up with you guys in the next one. Until then, peace.